You know, it's, it's a regular thing. The path I've chosen involves seven day work weeks. And a lot of times that means several weeks at a time where I'm going seven day work weeks. And it's just part of the deal. And I, a lot of times when you're living like that, you're going to hit an emotional wall or a mental wall or even a physical wall. And I can think of just this week in the middle of doing burpees and I can barely breathe and I'm sitting there staring off into space asking myself, why? Why am I doing this? Um, just this week, getting three hours of sleep and waking up at 6 a.m. ready to go again and staring at the wall and going, why? Why do I do this? But every time I ask myself why, I think about the miracle that happened on the day I tried to take my own life. I remember sleeping in the bushes and having nowhere to go and no one to talk to. I remember saying the first honest prayer I ever said and having it answered. I remember uh, the friends that I've lost to the disease of addiction or uh, when they take in their own life, you know, even in sobriety, the friends that I've lost. And that's why. And it makes all these other little things and being tired and having to push, push, push. Um, it makes all those things more than worth it. It makes those things just seem so small when I think about the reason why. And so today I really want you to remember and I want you to think about and I want you to grasp your why. Why are you doing what you're doing? Um, never forget your why because it makes all those little things and all those days where you're just working, working, working and pushing, um, you remember why. And then you just have to smile and you're all of a sudden so much more grateful. And all that stuff means just so much more. Uh, never forget your why. Always know your why. Um, I appreciate you guys. I hope you have a great week. We'll see you next time. Thank you.